everybody, Ann here, just sitting here in the tiny house, having my coffee with all of you, the lovely Miss Judy back there. Well, last night, I got something delivered. It was late. It was, I don't know, it was dark outside, but the UPS driver rolled on up and delivered me something, so here it is. UPS just came. It's dark outside and they're still making deliveries. So I'm not sure I know what this is. Look at that box. Well, I had ordered a bunch of stuff uh, with my Christmas money from Amazon, but I'm not expecting that to come till like Friday, Saturday, and, and next week. So I guess there's nothing else left to do, but... Alrighty, there's two little pieces of tape right here. Excuse me, Judy. Let's see if I can get into this. Like this. And over here... All right, let's open this baby up. Hold on. Oh my goodness. Look at, it's the buckle. It is the buckle. Let me get it out of this because this is like shrink wrap to it. Look at, look at, it's the Baco. It is a Baco Force 24 inch bow saw. I cannot freaking believe that I have one of these now. I can't believe it. Just like Feral Gal suggested, uh, Karen, thank you so much. I did a lot of research on these bow saws and which ones are best to use. I watched a lot of videos and this is the one that came out on top and it is perfect size. I can handle it. I can hold it. It's not too heavy. It comes with a greenwood uh, saw blade and you can get different. You can get a dry blade saw blade for it too, but most of what I'm going to be cutting up is going to be greenwood anyhow. So that's why I picked this one. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. And this comes from, oh, let's see. Enjoy your gift. Hope it helps from Michael B. I'm just going to say Michael B. Michael B, it absolutely does help. Thank you so much. I cannot wait to get this thing in action, to take it out and start cutting some wood. I saw somebody fall an entire tree with one of these. So yeah, thank you, Michael. This is truly amazing. I think I'm set for the wood processing department now. I've got my Fisker's axe. I've got my Baco bow saw. I'm ready. So yeah, later on in this video, it's probably going to be the next day because it's dark outside. I will show me putting this to use. Thank you so much, Michael. It's early Christmas present. Love it. Oh my goodness. You know, I... I have been blessed so many times by so many people. It's just, it's mind-blowing. So, you guys, thank you so very much. And, Michael, that is going to be put to good use, but it's not going to be put to use today because guess what? I get to go thrifting. Yay! Oh, and, yeah, I, I cut the bangs. I didn't do such a great job. I think I took it a little bit too far this way, and I need to kind of go and do this because it's sort of like, you know... <laughs> it's just like that. Anyhow, so, um, well, I get to go thrifting. Yay! Guess what, guys? Look who I'm with. Say hey! Hey! hey We're going thrifting. I can't wait. And look at my bangs. are still kind of janky. Oh, well. We are at the family thrift store in Henderson, Tennessee. There's only two cars out here, but it says it's open. Yay! I had to turn down the volume for this because there was music playing in the background, but look at all the clothes. Oh my goodness, and look at this robe. It looks so soft and comfy. I don't know though. I found these pants and they are in very good condition. They feel and look almost brand new. Found them in the men's department, size medium, six bucks. I'm gonna try them on and see if they fit. Oh, these are nice. I went there today specifically looking for a hoodie and I found one. This is very large. It's oversized. It is completely fleece lined. The hood is lined. It is just so soft and in such good condition. It's a 4XL for six bucks. Oh, I know I'm getting it. So guys, did you pick out good stuff? I did. I did. He spent way more of my money than I did. I'm just saying. Just like a man. I know. <laughs> we went in to get me two pairs of jeans and we came out $60 later and I got two pairs of jeans. And a jacket. Oh, and a jacket. I got one pair of camel pants and a big, huge, plush hoodie, and my hair's been rained on. Look at this. Look at this. Doesn't that look... You're so sexy, though. I did. I did like a weird cut of my bangs, didn't I? I think it looks just fine. 
<laughs> I, paid I think to say she's that. beautiful no matter what she does, y'all. So. so where are we going now? Where are we going now? That antique store? It's a feel. We can stop by the antique store if you want to look around. I probably can't spend money, but we can go look around because I love Let's window shopping. Let's just look around. And love window shopping, y'all. Me too. Country antiques and glassware. I cannot wait to look at that. Oh, they got a boat. Oh, my goodness. Let's check this out, guys. I'm bummed. I didn't get anything. What'd you get? We got, well, I did. I found a... Weatherford porcelain nativity scene. This little six-piece set for y'all, two dollars and fifty-eight cents. Yeah, nice one. And it's really cute figurine. It's an, I don't know how old it is. It's pretty old, but it's a Santa in his sleigh, and it's got some jingle bells and a couple of little elves. It's just like a ceramic figurine thing. It's cute. Super cute for four dollars. So. I saw stuff I wanted to get, my, but my accountant told me she no. wouldn't. She wouldn't. She the was, accountant says the bank is closed. That's what happened. <laughs> my bank is closed too. <laughs> But you know what? I am definitely going to come back to this uh, place. Yes. Definitely. Me too. Let me find my phone, honey. bangs were a mistake. I don't know why. I just got to cut my bangs every once in a while. I should never, ever, ever cut my bangs again. So it's back to the ball cap. I don't know. Maybe I can get in there and fix it or something like that. Anyhow, I had a great day today. It was really nice being able to get out with some other people and just do some shopping and whatnot and hanging out and laughing. It was a lot of fun. And those two pieces of clothing that I got were both from the men's department. I've discovered that I can wear a men's size medium. Well, at least in that kind of clothing and they fit perfect. So many of my clothes I've shrunk out of and they're just like bagging and hanging off me but I did get the hoodie extra you know oversized I think it's like a 2xl maybe 3xl I'm not sure but I wanted something that was going to be nice and big and loose so that I could put on layers underneath of it sometimes I even sleep in my hoodie because I can pull it up over my head and I can stay all warm and if I like to go to sleep like this with my hand on my face and I won't be freezing my face off with my cold hands because I'll have the hoodie on so, yeah, it's just very, very soft and very warm. It's going to be wonderful. And, yeah, so I think I spent like, I don't know, 10 or $12 there. So that's not bad at all. I love, love thrifting. I could go thrifting every single day of my life if I had money. So, but anyhow, it is raining outside, and it is really coming down hard. So no outdoor projects. But tomorrow, hopefully it's not going to be raining and I'm going to get out there and put that Baco bow saw to good use. I'd like to process some more wood and there's some kind of like, not big tree trunks, but large limbs that I can cut, cut apart and whatnot. And I think that's going to do great on it. So I'm looking forward to that. Yeah, but it's got to stop raining. <sighs> I hope you all had a good day today. I know I did. Anyway, that's all I got for y'all today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.